na, it was that. So when I sang the tune, he said, make it, make cool la la into la la la. So I was wondering, what is the big difference? Thirida, Thirida is the greatest album. This Ti Ti, she's a, it's a Filipino who sung that song, a Tamil song. Can you believe? Anjali, Anjali, Pushpanjali. Anjali, Anjali, Pushpanjali. I sang the track and Raman liked it so much. So, so all that gives you hope. Tracking milestones of an incredible journey spanning 30 years. Rahman Music Sheets. Hi friends, how about finding a top take? A wow factor in this episode. Do watch it till the end to grab this harmonic moment of the day. Minsara Kanuva released in 1997. Dubbed in Hindi as Sapne. Directed by Rajiv Menon. Kajol's debut film in Tamil won four national awards and three Tamil Nadu State Film Awards. With this film, Srinivas gained recognition as a singer. Ooh la la la, it was, uh, that was a, one of the first times when I sang the track for a lyricist. The lyric writer Vairamuthu sir could not understand the tune because Rahman's tunes are very different. It's very difficult to write. So he wanted somebody who can sing it and show him and all that. So I was called in for that. So I sang the tune first and then they wrote lyrics and then I sang the song. So actually again Rahman, when I was singing the tune, -na 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 the tune was so nice and you know, it was different. So this is Raman's tune. So, ooh, la, la, it was that. So, when I sang the tune, he said, make it, make cool la, la, into la, la, la. So, I was wondering, what is the big difference? Ooh, la, la, and he said, make it, ooh, la, la, la. Who? Then, when I sang it, I realized, oh my God, that's a huge difference here. Yeah. It makes it more peppy. Such small things, you know, but it makes a huge impact. And then I sang, when the lyrics came, I sang everything. Even when the Hindi lyrics came, I sang. I sang and left. And then later on, Rajiv Menon told me that my voice is okay because Rahman said that, see, oh, that he sings really well. Rahman is very earlier when some other song he gave me and I sang well but the director did not approve or something. So Rahman's famous, the, those days he used to say that his male are the switch on he used to say, which means that upar se switch on nahi hua uska. Wo achha gata hai. God is not. <laughs> Something like that is told Rajiv. And Rajiv said, let's switch it on now. <laughs> and that's what he, Rajiv told me. And, and he, he told Rahman to retain my voice. And that's how it happened. And Rahman was happy to do that. So can you sing a few lines of that song? You want it in Hindi or Tamil? I'll sing Hindi first. Ik bagiya me rehti hai ik maina. Poochti hai ki bolo kya hai kehna. Mera rang hasi hai kya? Mera ang hasi hai kya? Kabhi pooche to mera jawab yehi hoga. Hu la la la. Hoo la 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 
एक है रास्ता रास्ते में गाड़ी है गाड़ी में है लड़की मड़े तुली मणिल वंद सिंद छिंद एलगिरदे ஒரு வாசம் அது எனை வானவில் கொண்டு சேர்த்து விடுகிறது சில நேரம் சாங் கால் கையில் மிதக்கும் த ரசாயன் ரட்சகன் கையில் As I was singing, there was only one Kail midakum kanavani And then Nilavil porulkhal That he had made already and Kadal thai mai randu mattum Baram in badi ari yadu Un paling mughatthai pārthu kundal Pasiyo valiyo Thiriyadu Then I think I made a mistake Thiriyadu I was doing some, some practice I landed on this note This I presume that I did that Then he suddenly said The next phrase is the same tune He said no 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 now you do this And he composed on the spot உன்னை மட்டும் சுமந்து நடந்தால் இஃப் த சிங்கர் மேக்ஸ் அ மிஸ்டேக் ஹீல் கம்போஸ் அ மேஜிக்கல் ஃப்ரேஸ் ஃப்ரம் தட் மிஸ்டேக் அண்ட் மேக் இட் ஒர்க் தட் இஸ் த கிரேட்னஸ் ஆஃப் பிரேமான் காதல் தாய் மை ரெண்டு மட்டும் கேன் வி சே தட் திஸ் வாஸ் யுவர் ஃபர்ஸ்ட் சோலோ சாங் வேர் மிஸ்டர் ரஹ்மான் ரிலைட் ஆன் யூ டோட்டலி யா இட் தி சோலோ ஃபர்ஸ்ட் சோலோ சாங் வாஸ் மிஸ்டர் ரோமியோ and then ulalala happened in three languages uh, uh, but my i i would say that this song is the one which he looked at me okay now i think you are ready i mean, he will never say that in so many words he will just smile and he, you can see that he is happy okay i said okay my life is made he is happy with this song maybe i think he'll give me a few more kayo vida kum kanavani கை கால் முளைத்த காற்றானி கையில் ஏந்தியும் கணக்கவில்லையே நூறாயா செய்த சிலையானி மச் பிஃபோர் ரக்ஷகணா அண்ட் மின்சார கனுவு The first association of Srinivas and Rahman began with Gentleman in 1993. And then came Thiruda Thiruda, also dubbed in Hindi as Chor Chor. After Roja, this was the second film when Mani Ratnam and A.R. Rahman collaborated. A crime thriller. Thiruda Thiruda won two national awards for special effects and choreography. For many, Thiruda Thiruda figures amongst Rahman's most brave and innovative soundtracks. It is known for introducing relatively unknown vocalists into mainstream Tamil playback singing. It also remains one of Rahman's most under-recognized soundtracks. Veera Bandi Kottayile Thiruda Thiruda was an album which you never understood what it is in the beginning it is so addictive it it is such an addictive album those days you used to listen to it on loop and the sound of thrida thrida is something else and it's a completely different sounding album and uh, the, uh, from from those times especially it is people say people like amit trivedi says it's the it is the best album of ar rahman nobody could understand what he had done it was that it was way way ahead of its times like to use chorus like that ch 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 charara cha ch 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 charara ta charara ru charara ru ta 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 kandum 
கண்ணும் கொள்ளை அடித்தார் காதல் என்றே அர்த்தம் ராக் கிட்டார் காம்ஸ் அண்ட் what is that what are you listening to <laughs> it's that kind of feel you thought you got kannum kannum kollai adithal kaadal endru artham and then there's one song which has only voices a cappella one one guy is like scream i mean he's like that shaul i mean is singing as it's, it's the last song that he'll ever sing he sings heart out and lament is so real tara vit oh he is just singing like that ra sati ye usre yanadi she sing like that he sing i am finished and then there's mm, mm, it is you could not there was nothing like that you have heard no? thiruda thiruda is the greatest album ra sati ye usre yanadi there's one chandralekha which every singer sang after that there was there was no show without chandralekha even today chandralekha gets sung konjam nilavu konjam neruppu a singer called anupama who who just needs one song for her anu uh, uh, chandralekha and what is that song this titi she is is a filipino who sang that song a tamil song can you believe it and then putam pudu bhoomi went the kind of the 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 the, the, the chorus in that with western notations and all that it is just incredible no? are you listening to an international album is what we used to think then and the uh, and the violas the see that that is where rahman you know uh, raja sir had we thought he had done everything with as far as strings is concerned <music> rahman sir with strings with violins he did completely something else other than what raja sir has done that is his he knew that raja sir was a genius and he has done all that i have to do something else so if you listen to the puttam pudu bhoomi vendum third interlude you will know what i am talking about with violas and and that sound is the string sound itself is completely different and dynamics again you all know that think that i am talking like an ar rahman fanboy yes of course but beyond that i am a lover of music it's not because he gave me songs to sing he gave me songs because he uh, probably i deserved to sing that but it's not i am always grateful to that person that man i love him for that that's a different thing but his music is far greater than his his music is what makes him sir in gentleman thiruda thiruda bombay you were largely singing as part of chorus backup vocals or scratches you hardly had any independent lines in those songs so uh, did it create some kind of apprehensions anxieties uncertainties in your mind about your future i mean i wouldn't say there were no apprehensions but then i was loving it i was enjoying it and i was i knew that i was learning mr rahman was molding me into a singer and there were other music directors also like vidya sagar sharath and i was singing for so many people it was a brilliant phase in my life because i was sought after i was one of the and people were say at that point of time everyone was saying that you you should get a, an opportunity you should get an opportunity so that kept me going so i felt okay somewhere somewhere i think mr rahman will look uh, will give me something and he also kept trying also like uh, it, it, uh, there were so many songs like anjali 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 pushpanjali i sang the track and rahman liked it so much so so all that gives you hope anjali anjali 
And of course, the film reminded the, the, the director, the producer, they said, no, no, we want an established one. This is for S.P. Balasubramanian only, nobody else will sing. Though Rahman asked, can he sing one antra at least? Anjali, Anjali, Pushpa Anjali. But I feel, if I had got that opportunity then itself, then I wouldn't have grown as a, I wouldn't have grown as, number one, a singer, as a human being. When you see, when you struggle and then come up and your opportunities, your so-called achievements, then you can look back and still be humble about it. But if you getting a, right from the word go, you, you start, you know, everything is whatever, you just walk into somewhere and then you get everything. Then you won't realize the, you won't get, have the value for that. So I'm so thankful to Mr. Rahman that he did not straight away, he, because of course he won't. As I told you, for him, it's the final product that matters. It has to be according to what he thinks, what he envisages. And he will only go for the best. If you have sung for Mr. Rahman, if there are songs that you have sung for him, it means that you have done some kind of justice, you have done justice, total justice, otherwise you won't keep your voice. So I could see all that, I could see, and there were so many great songs being made and I was enjoying my music, enjoying my time in the studios, the chorus sessions were amazing. He made me into what I am today, there is no doubt about it. Singing for Rajnikant and getting a Tamil Nadu State Film Award for the same song can be a dream for any singer. Srinivas hadn't even dreamt of this. Yet, it happened. With many more untold stories, in our next episode, Srinivas will be back. Stay with us. So, Rahman's Famous, uh, those days he used to say that his male uh, and the switch on, he used to say, which means that upper se switch on nahi hua uska. Wo achha gata hai, lekin upper se switch on nahi hua. Matlab, God has not, <laughs> something like that is told Rajiv. And Rajiv said, let's switch it on now. <laughs> and that's what he, Rajiv told me and and he, he told Rama to retain my voice. Do you agree that this indeed was the moment of the day? Is your choice different? Whatever your mind says, write it in the comments section below. We will be waiting. Subscribe to our YouTube channel, press the bell icon and stay entertained.